Hey folks, welcome back to Stranded Alien Dawn. It is 3 in the morning on the 21st day. Yeah, it just seems to work out this way. I always start in the morning, but right now nothing's going on, so I can talk a little bit, not worried about uh, missing something. But we've got to make our trip today in our balloon. I think Edmund would be the best choice to send out there. Um, bricks are made. 15, nope, just 10 bricks at the moment. I'm going to get these guys built. Rita's getting up and get bricks going like crazy so Carter can finish this. And then maybe he can get back up there and work on the house some more. Um, we've got a place being set up for our future pooch over here. Is hmm, right there. So I have... Food ha for taming hasn't been discovered yet. We probably need to go hunting. I'm thinking that's raw red meat. Which means we need to pick one of these guys and make that happen. Yeah. So. We haven't observed. Ah, okay. What did I click there to get into that? No. Nope. There we go. I bumped something down here. Okay. Well, what's, what just flew by? <laughs> I see these things afterward. Anyway, so we're going to have to observe so that we can hunt. I think that's the right order. Yeah. Who's up and working? Carter's constructing a fence. Good job. Rita is handling a furnace. Rita, you are going to go directly to planting. But before I do that and and commit you to it now you're in pretty good shape all right so we got that planted let's plant pretty much everything else that can be planted and get it all done everything looks good over there you can finish off the tobacco over here and by then you should be pretty much tuckered out that's a bunch of, of branches that's right we got a lot of things that are not being picked up um, this has been here for quite a while. So I think Deliver has kind of fallen by the wayside. Need to assign somebody to deliver some things. Deliver meaning put everything away. So Rita's planting. Edmund is handling hot air blue. And he's uh, get, putting fuel in it. Um, Simon and Paulette are still sleeping. And that's fine. They, uh, they, they don't get a cue to wake up till 7. So they must need it. The other ones didn't. They got up on their own. Uh, Edmund is handling still. So what does that mean at the moment? That's not Edmund. You are... I don't know. There's no fuel over here. What else are you getting for the hot air balloon? The balloon needs fuel. It has fuel. So you are... Handling a furnace. Never mind. <laughs> So we could let you go, Edmund. Why don't you come grab a meal? Uh, what does that mean nowadays? Drink coffee, drink coffee. Yeah, meals. Right there. So we got veggie soup, meat soup. Um, is that in here? Veggie soup is 63%. I don't see meat soup anywhere. You are meat soup. And you're 69%. So, Edmund, when you're done, come on over and grab a veggie soup. Um, which shelf are you on nowadays? Right there. So, come over here and eat that. When that's done, I think we're going to put you in a hot air balloon and see what happens. Edmund is reading. <laughs> okay. Well, you'll, you'll have your happiness all the way up then. Yep. Okay, so Paulette is cooking. And that surprises me every time. I feel like I'm being attacked by an animal from behind me when I hear that. <laughs> um, I want to say someone like Paulette. You're probably the best one. Can you haul and haul? And what else is just kind of sitting around here? Somebody finally got the, the healing balm picked up. Um, is that all? Well, we had this. Hall. And one more thing. Now we're looking pretty good now. Alright, you do those tasks. I probably... 
Oh, you did do it. Okay. Oh, that's Edmund. There you are. Oh, he got inspiration. That's what that little symbol was. Okay. So she's putting all that away. Um, are there any other tasks just floating out there? We still have that last one to, to harvest. Um, research is what needs to be done. Simon, you are researching. There you are. Researching refrigerators. Okay. Let's get you to research an Olfen. Just so we've got the ability to make, I assume, dog food. Um, I'm seeing them out there. That's the one we had set. These do seem a little bit closer. Is there nothing closer? There's nothing up the hillside. Got two of you guys. And from what I'm hearing, the animals, as you tame them, they will... Some of them have the potential to do things for you. Uh, whether it be camp protection, um, digging up rocks, um, it, I guess they each have their own little characteristic or bonus. So we may have to tame one of everything before the series is done just to see what that means. But Simon, let's head out here and research one of these guys. Probably you. Observe. Okay, that gets that done. And Simon, happiness is low. Is. Okay, can I have you read a story first? Already rela Oh, that's not it. So Simon, what's your problem? You just need a meal. Okay, then come on over to... I just had it. Where's the shelf? Right there. That's not clicking. Okay, we'll go out over here. Right there. Eat veggies first. And then go over here and observe. Does that work? Simon, there you are. You envied Edmund for improving their skills. So I take it that's a bonus or not? Envied is usually a negative thing. Um, slept, sat, ate, ate, many, enough. Okay, Edmund. I'm not seeing a Simon thing there. Anyway, let that one go. Just looking for... Ooh, Carter actually likes somebody now. Paulette and Rita. Negatives. Oh, there's a... Rita has... At least has a favorable opinion of Carter now. Otherwise, everyone else is all in the reds. Okay, so Edmund is going to construct. Edmund, let's get you going here. You got a meal. That's what I was waiting for. Your happiness is is all the is aiming for there. Okay, that's what I wanted to see. So you can disappear for a while and not be in too horrible a shape when you get back. You expedition crash landing. Two days plus a little plus a few hours left. Right there, we're going to send Edmund. Send expedition. Rescue pod fell in the area. There may be a survivor. And escape. And what does he do? He's on an expedition. Let's watch this process. So he is. He had to walk over there to tell someone? Apparently so. Maybe you had to go check his food level or something. Anyway, you are getting in. Let's see. Back up as far as I can. And let's... Oh, observing the bighorn animal. Observing Edmund leaving. All right. Light that fuel and... There he goes. And I can't get... I guess I can get a little higher here. Something like that. Bye-bye. And that's it. He's gone. All right. The rest of us have got things to do. Rita, I sent you on a lot of orders. You're still doing fine. Simon, you're out over there. Double click. And Paulette is holding down the fort. Carter is constructing fence. Oh, there's the there's the shadow for the balloon. <laughs> and yet, oh, there it is. We can see it. Oh, cool. And it's gone. Okay. I need these furnaces going. So you have got enough to do all that. So when you are done constructing, I want you to get these furnaces built so we can get all five of them going. So construct those next. All right. 
Yeah, everyone's got things to do and they're all nice and busy. Let's set some things up for the future. We don't have enough fuel to do this anymore, but we can put you there. And that's our diesel generator. Well, nowadays everyone knows how to make electro electrical energy through combustion. Designing a device that would not combust itself in the process is a bit harder, though. All right, so we figured out diesel generators. Uh, Carter is constructing furnaces. Good. So we need to power this guy. We need to eventually... What you doing? Well, they hover pretty good. Wouldn't it be cool if the grass was waving from the wind that he, his wings are making? <laughs> but we also need to think about a refrigerator over here. And so many other things are going on. Rita reached farming eight. Great. And we just pickled our first vegetables. All right. Salted and fermented vegetables. Okay. Rita's eight acquired enough practical experience to increase her farming level. So she is going to be farming quickly now. Uh, 10 is our max. So she's almost there. Anyway, electrical power poles. So I want to connect this device the, the soldering bench, you can see the cords. We can only go so far before we're out of range of it. And I want it to look decent, so I don't really want to run these down the middle. Although, that being said, that would connect to everything with that one pole. Oh, I never thought about that. I was going to make a pathway all the way around, but... Okay. I can do that. It'll, it should connect to the refrigerator here, too. All right, so you're going to be there, but we do need to get a hold of our uh, um, lightning rods. That's the word I'm looking for. So we could shoot you across. Let's see. You will not connect to this guy, but you will connect to the refrigerator. I wonder if there's a chance that they can piggyback through like that, or if they have to have an actual power pole in between. That's right in the middle of our pathway, so I don't want to go there. Could this have gone here? No, the, the seats take up those squares. Okay. So I guess you're just going to have to be off at an awkward angle like that. Okay, so you're there. But we need to get to this guy somehow. Can I shoot across? Oh, I'm only off by one. All right, so let's say we cancel you and move you a little bit further out. So construct you. Does that work? No, I want to. Copy. Okay. So, where can I get to from this? Oh, I cannot reach across that garden. Darn. Okay. So, I guess I'm taking you down the length like this. Could. And then I can get out to here. And then I can get across to there. And then I can get across to here and grab all of those. Okay, then we need to get up and grab a hold of these as well. But they don't, I don't necessarily have to have that done today. Alright, we'll stop there. That gets the, the core electric grid figured out, plus two of the four lightning rods. Okay, so it'll be a while before that all gets built, but that's that off of my to-do list. Let's put it that way. We discovered Olfen. Cool. And we lost some harvest. Usually passive, small chance to retaliate when attacked. And does that mean that we have discovered dog food? Uh, required food? I wish that would pop up, but I'm... Taming food, okay. Dried meat, is that what that is? It won't pop up, I don't know what that means. Um, let's take a look over here that would be you does that symbol show up in here right there dried meat okay so we need dried meat for dog training and we probably need dried meat really for our trips too. something some food that will last for a while so Simon you are out here you actually could do a bit of a hunt you could this guy's kind of separated from the pack Let's hunt him, and Simon, let's have you do it. Let's see how this works. Oh, that's going to take forever. We don't have our railgun snipers anymore. 
Mm. Boy, okay, we need help. <laughs> Rita, it's got to be you. Come on out here and... Oh, we're only allowed to do it one at a time? We can't team up? All right, draft and come out here. And... Yep. Simon, I guess it's practice. It's 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 a chance to build up your hunting skills. But yeah, Rita, I need you to help finish this job here. We're going to be hunting him all the way across the map at this rate. And I suppose there is a chance that he might retaliate. I don't know. Rita, where are you right now? Come on out here and, and uh, help Simon finish the job here. Yeah. <laughs> okay, so otherwise Carter is... Oh, you got these going. All right, so let me pause a second here, set you guys up. Bake bricks forever and bake bricks forever. And Carter, why don't you... Paulette, why don't you set these guys up? So bake bricks and bake bricks. All right, so back to Rita who's going to head over to here. And I'm sure the rest of these guys are not very happy. All right, so when you get there, can you quickly put him out of his misery? Oh, he said, uh-uh. Okay, get it done quick. Get it done quick. Get it done quick. And he's down. Okay. Hmm. So, the skill for butchering, I'm pretty sure, is delivery. I think it's what we decided that was. So, it doesn't really matter who does it, because that isn't a skilled up thing. So, let's just have Simon go ahead and butcher, and then haul in Simon, Simon, butcher. How come that didn't work? Simon, because nobody else, I didn't have anybody else clicked. Hmm. Okay. You're handling a fermentation barrel. All right, so I want to see Simon. You are transporting. That's what's actually called, which is the same as delivery on the other chart. Activity, deliver. Wouldn't it be nice if they used the same word? I think it would. Um, you are running in. I should probably let you rather than switch you back over to planting and have you go to a slow walk again. If you're willing to run in, I'll, 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 I'll take that. But it looks like you're being chased. No, they're just uh, wanting to get friendly. Okay. Simon's butchering. We'll have to get back over there and make sure he actually brings the meat in. Um, you're on your way to handle... What was it? A... Should say over your name a fermentation barrel. But when you get here, what I actually want you to do is to plant corn. And then we'll go check on si Simon's already transporting. What are you bringing? You're bringing 49 meat. And you've left the hides behind. Okay, that's good. Rita, you are going to plant this. And then. For the most part, you're done, though I see we've got some of these to harvest, and I know we still have these to harvest. We want to get these in before they're gone. Expedition complete. Crash, crashed rescue pod. All right, I found a survivor. Welcome to our camp. Kana joins, plus 18 happiness. Or another mouth to feed, leave them behind. Minus 10 happiness. Now, let's bring Kana to our camp. Great. So, we've got a Kana. Who is Akana? Kana is... Well, she'll get here eventually, but I guess we could do this now. And if I stay like this, I wonder if we'll see them appear. Uh, oh, she is a fellow writer. Interesting. Kana is unarmed. Uh, yeah, but she's not here yet, game. I'm going to pause. Relaxes by writing short stories that inspire others to read and refuses to eat meat. Ah, so a little higher emphasis on the, where am I? On the veggie soup. 
Okay. Make sure there's always some in stock. Kana, from satisfyingly gross slimes to intricate jewelry, I had to read that carefully, there is nothing that the talented Kana can't make from regular household items and cheap craft supplies. Oh, he's saying she's crafting. Oh, that's good. All right. Her book, Change Your Life with the Magic of DIY, became a bestseller, and Kana has millions of followers on social media, eagerly awaiting her latest tips and tricks. Or were. Now she's gone. Veggie Stew is her favorite and appreciates decorations. Oh, so Veggie Stew and a shroom torch, and she is just happy as can be, and she writes her stories. Okay, so she is into crafting big time. Not interested in construction and hates combat just like Paulette. That's going to be rough. They're all going to be negatives because they're going to have to fight with us. There's no way around that. Okay. All right. Let this run. Um, anything else? Health is good. And great happiness stacked up there for a while. She's got uh, the standard issue clothes. And we're going to say uh, no raw foods and no moonshine for now. Okay, not in view yet. And let's grab the activities. And she kind of, I would put her as a two handle is the same as everybody else. Construct she wants nothing to do with. And I'm waiting for that balloon to show up. Um, Lost Harvest is popping in here and there. Okay. Let's pause. I don't know what everybody's up to right now. And we're running out of daytime. Although at 1800, it's not looking that dark. I was wondering if the days seem longer now that we're in the near the end of summer. Anyway, Construct was a no, right? Tell you what, I'll roll through all of this and show you at the end. All right, I think that will work. I set her delivery as a one, so she, at least one of them will be, by default, out there to quickly take care of any deliveries. Um, she was not into combat, so I took her hunt down to nothing, not not even on, not even a five, just like Paulette. And I'm gonna give her twos on all the craftings. Paulette's are ones, but Paulette also defaults to cooking. And eventually we'll set Rita back to a one there as well. Yeah, because all of Rita's regulars are out on this side of it. So they've got to be twos with a one there. But when Paulette finishes the one, she'll drop into her next ones. That should... Actually, it won't be much different if I did that. Other than that one is in there, which is important anyway. Otherwise, that will be her next one, next one to go to, even if it was a one or a two. Okay, so I think that works okay. Schedule. Let's pop that in real quick. So sleep. Uh, not mention. No mention of something like night owl. Don't know if that is a thing in this game. So I don't have to worry about when they sleep and when they don't. All right. So Rita's planting this area. Paulette is handling a furnace. Which means she's getting more bricks going. Good. Um, so, unarmed. So, weapons, we are sitting with what? Four short bows. Okay, so let's get weapons back into the list here. Need to quickly craft, actually back up here, a spear and a crossbow. Get those going. Otherwise, what? Carter's constructing a power pole. Uh, Carter, why did you go up here to construct a power pole? You went to go get logs, didn't you? Okay. Well, I don't want to bother your... Yeah, you've gone all that, that way, but I would want you to get back to this as soon as you can. So, construct five uh, brick fences. Discovered Olfen, we can get rid of that. Uh, unarmed, we know. And she hasn't arrived yet, and I don't see the balloon 
rolling in. Otherwise, we need to get somebody to get some more fermentation going. Of fuel, I'm thinking. So, oh, we have... No, we're waiting for it. Okay. Paula is handling a furnace. Simon is researching. Simon, why don't you come over and... Device is working. How is it I'm not seeing that? In production, 2%. Ah, I guess 2% isn't enough to give us a, a, a little blue bar here. That's why it didn't look like it. Okay. Uh, no balloon out there. There's a lot popping at me. So, oh, these out here are all going bad. That must be what's going on. Okay, well, we're not going to get to them tonight. If there's any left tomorrow, maybe we can do that. We'll see. Uh, Paula is handling one more furnace. And... New insect nest. Oh, something just sprouted up. Okay, hello. You are... Over here... Compared to, let me figure out where the other nest was. Okay, I gotta get my bearings. We went there by going through here. No, we didn't. Let me get all the way back to camp. Carter, okay. We went through here, we went up this path here to get to it and there's the insect nest that we already know about so we got this one and this one so we're saying that another one is formed where was that I don't know boy you can get lost in this map it is much bigger than it re than you realize okay so the four rocks where were those four rocks there it is. Nope, there it is. Okay, I gotcha. So that's there compared to out over here and down the hill. Compared to over there. Alright, now I got my bearings through the rocks to that one or up here to this one, these two. So we have three insect nests nearby. Once we defeat them, we've got three rounds of carbon nanotubes available later. Okay. Well, there's a lot of noise in these rocks. How would you like to live next to that all the time? <laughs> okay. Zip back over here and waiting for our balloon to arrive. Meanwhile, what's happening? Simon is researching. Is there anything else that needed to be done? We don't have the dried meats. So we can't go get the pooch yet, the dog. Um, there was hay that could have been um, could have been harvested. Rita is almost done. I want to give her a break, but she's so close to finishing, I think I'd rather just... I know she's going to be uh, pretty worn out by the end of this. Yeah. She's going to be a little frustrated, but so much, so little left to do. Just sprinkle those in, then you're free. Lots of bricks going on. I asked Carter to do this. Is he grabbing a meal? And then... Nothing stacked to do after that. Where is he? He is sitting right there. Um, why don't you get these in? Why I have no idea which day we're going to get nailed next. So Carter, when you're done, do that. So we're constructing four more since there were five of them. Uh, Brick is sitting out here. He got that far and he went to go get a meal. Okay. Paulette is celebrating the Shroom Torch. Um, where am I going? Up here. And looking for that balloon. I am not seeing anything up there like that. So that's not happening yet. Rita's grabbing food. Simon's researching. Paulette is reading. And everything is fine. So I can turn that off. No, it won't let me. Okay. New insect nest. We saw that. Um, oh, there they are. Can I click it? I kind of can. Alright, so they're on their way back. Um, Edmund 
sleeps over here. He brought Kana. So she gets to share a bunk with him. Hopefully they get along. And we're here. So come on in, grab a meal, folks. Going to sleep? How you doing, health-wise? You're decent and decent. Okay. So go get some sleep and and we will get kind of armed in the morning. She's got her routine for uh, tomorrow. What she gets to do next. Carter is not clickable. He's going to get more bricks. Um, we're at midnight. Yeah, why don't you just continue that. Hopefully tomorrow these will all be cooked and that'll be enough bricks to finish the job. Simon, before you go to sleep, can you bake these bricks? Thank you. Uh, Paulette is making more veggie soup. And Carter is grabbing... Is that enough? Well, Carter, while you're here, just bring all the bricks for all of it. So, Carter, there we go. Can you do all of them? So, will you stop and go grab more? Grab that and grab more. Good. Uh, Simon, sure. Well, right now, why don't you also bake these bricks? And that's all Carter's going to bring. Okay. Well, I'll quit... Uh, pestering them. Paulette is eating. She's off to bed. Simon will be off to bed here in just a moment. Carter, I'll stop you. We'll see how quickly you build these. If they're real quick, I'll leave you alone. Otherwise, I'll stop you once you make the delivery. But I think you're carrying ten is what I'm, I'm guessing you've got, which is only three of those. We'll see. Uh, speed you up a little bit. Boom, 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 boom. And constructing is actually pretty fast. Okay, so pop those in. So tomorrow you should be able to finish building this pretty easily. Even if we get a bug attack alert, there should still be enough time to actually get it finished. You can go to bed. All right, that's done. All right, back to my list. Pipes. I wanted to get pipes into the crafting, but we're still waiting. Oh, we're almost there, 93%. We have to have dried smoke leaf before we can before it will let me um, even choose it. Got a lot of noise starting up. A lot of wind noise. What if we got a rainstorm coming in? Okay, so let's see if yeah, now we're starting to get a blue bar. It takes a while to make this uh, this fuel. And we're going to need the fuel to make the generator as well as get out on another trip to find out oh, Edmund's hungry to find out what that is but not yet not this trip uh, maybe one trip after each bug attack that might be a good way to deal with that because I want all hands on deck when we're being attacked um, Kana is up for now Kana, come and equip a short bow. At least you'll have some kind of a weapon. And who... What does Kana look like? There she is. And... So you are first set for delivering, and then you are set for... handling. So you should... So you're going to do the transporting. Okay, so... It's called deliver, but... Here it's called transport, so she's going to start unloading things. That's good. So she take care of all of the miscellaneous, then she should dive into probably the sewing bench. Or that wind noise. Or some kind of noise. Maybe it's these. Ah, I bet you it's these. And she's, oh, she's going to go fill up all of the construction um, projects too. Okay, well that's really handy. I like that. I see Carter has done that as well. Yeah, if he can get all these built, we might be able to start utilizing at least these two um, lightning rods. Nice. All right, this is our second day, so our episode is halfway done. Anything else out here? So, hey, Rita, 
is out to harvest. She needs to get some more stuff done before I can get her to leave. So, Rita, why don't you come out and... What's the chance we've got a buttermelon pie here? We do not. Got to get those going. Buttermelon pie, so let's have Rita eat, eat a veggie soup. And then let's have her... Probably play a didgeridoo. And then... I want you out here to harvest this. Uh, blade grass cut. And that thump was a wall? Something just got built. I wish they wouldn't use a thump for this. <laughs> okay, Khan is transporting wood. And she brought those bricks. There must be more bricks sitting around. That would probably land in here. Um, bricks, yep. So that means there must still be some bricks in the kiln. Like those right there. Okay, so Edmund's going to transport as well. Alright, Simon is appreciating decorations. And... What? Idling, right? Question mark. Yeah. Now you're going to go play an instrument and get that up. Kana, what you up to? You're delivering wood. Yeah, we're going to start seeing some serious progress now. That sixth person is really going to be a, a benefit here. So if we can get these walls filled, which means, Edmund, it'd be great if you could... What are you doing now? Handling a furnace, your relaxation could use some help. Why don't you instead come over here and do this, and then I want you to get in and cut some trees. Um, cut and then cut all of these and I suppose while you're at it then come on down and just jump into the middle of all this and cut some of those that should give us enough wood to finish up this part of the house and we can get that all built Carter's eating <clears throat> how are we doing here nope he hasn't been out this far yet but hopefully some more bricks will be done and we'll get that in Ah, Paulette is handling the cook stove. Can you instead... Where's Hall? Reserve by Kana. Okay, she's got that. So I see Rita is harvesting. Oh, so Rita never made it out there to cut the blade grass. Okay, dried smoke leaf is here. Whoa, Edmund discussed good meal with Simon, but he's doing some serious moving here. I wonder if movement speed increases with physical. Huh. Edmund is for physical now. Do we have a way of seeing movement speed? Yeah, well, 100%. Okay. Rita. Of course, they're all 100%, but it doesn't really give you a sense of speed. Um... No, no numbers. Okay. Anyway, Rita. Yeah, okay. This is important. Now yeah, we're losing more harvest out there. That's just going to have to be good enough. When does this come in? It's not that far. Average health 100%, growth 68%. Okay. As far as losing more of it over here, this is going to be available to us soon. And we still have in stock 370. I suppose that's fine. So this last one, and then Rita, I want you. Okay, two over there. All right, we'll get those two done. Then I've got to get you up there and get that blade grass. Actually, that's cut, not harvest. Oh, I think of plants as harvest. Edmund, you could do that. You could, and you can haul back more. Where are you at right now? Double faster. All right, so you're going to do these... Let's do the one, and then I'm going to send you back out, out there to do that. All right, a little bit of change of plans here. So Edmund cutting. Come on out over here and cut ten of those, and then cut ten of those, and if there's anything left, five of those. Okay. You come out and do those things. Um, pipes. Let's go set pipes into the uh, craft bench. Right there, craft, pipes, 
give me... Let's give everybody a pipe. That shouldn't take too long to do it. Uh, just times. Okay. So, spear and crossbow first, then you can move into pipes. In... Hello. Veggie leather. We'll move that above the veggie leather. Okay. So, tools are first, but you're cooking first, right? Paulette, you are going to make a spear. Oh, good. Okay. So, that's the higher priority. There's all the bricks. Carter is constructing. He's bringing a few more bricks out. He's doing the last one. Okay. So, I would imagine we have an attack coming next episode. We'll see how that goes. It tends to... Lately, it's been hitting at 8 in the morning each time. Um... <clears throat> Once that attack is done, we can send Edmund off for another trip. We can tear the rest of this out and get Carter to build it, which means keep the bricks coming, which means we need more grass, all right, more hay. All right, so that's good. Now, quantities, there's a lot. So we're gonna need another trip already. Simon, what are you researching, by the way? What do I keep interrupting? You are trying to get that refrigerator going. You're trying desperately. But until we get more fuel, there's no power for any of this. Though, while we're here, let's get batteries uh, into the list. Batteries need research energy storage. But that's what a battery is. Energy storage. Down here. So we need to make an electronic... Make or produce a circuit board in order to learn how to store power in order to build the thing that stores the power. Boy, that's a little convoluted if you ask me. Because I can't even use this until we've got the system going. Hmm. Okay. But, boy, I would love to be able to store a lightning strike. Which means a battery, not just a quick... And then it turns off again. Hmm. So Rita is transporting... Or Oh, she went to go get it. Okay. Rita's harvesting now. Harvesting means way over there because she got... Oh! That was silicon. Okay. Okay. Alright. That's good. So, I think we should just keep her on plants for a while. Now that we have Kana to take up some of the slack of crafting with Paulette, then Paulette, as her number one is cooking, seems to be a a pretty good idea but she is going to actually you know kind of could be doing the spear she could and that would get Paulette back into the uh, kitchen for a little bit let's let let's make that happen let's have Paulette carry it the rest of the way in first no point in having to do that trip twice uh, research refrigerators nice so refrigeration food Inevitably rots. Refrigerated food rots slower. Thus, fridges. <laughs> okay. So, Paulette's going to go there. Kana is transporting logs. Well, that should be finishing up in a moment. And, Paulette, we will have you make some foods. Maybe pumpkin pie. That'd be nice. So, drop that off there. Paulette, you please come over here and make me some buttermelon pie. Kana, where are you? You are transporting in 10 to drop it off on these walls over here. Perfect. When you're done with that, please come down over here and craft for yourself a spear and a crossbow. Am I pushing it there? You're... Yeah, I'll have to stop you at the spear. Actually, I'll have to stop you halfway through the spear and let you get a dinner. All right, boy feel like a lot's happened. So what's happening over here? Edmund is transporting. Go over to Edmund. So he didn't finish the job yet, or these are still to be done. That's probably okay. Simon, you're going to come up and grab whatever is left, since you got the fastest run. But let's see what Edmund can come up with. He's got, well, I guess 140 as far as you're going to go there. All right, so Simon, come on out and haul hay. Paulette is cooking. Rita is transporting what she just took down. Oh, great. 90 of these. And what are you? You are the tobacco. 
I hear there is a plant called, I think I saw it in a description somewhere, um, a root vegetable. But I have no idea what plant that could be. There aren't any other plants in this map that I'm aware of that we haven't already talked about. And something keeps popping. I think it's right in there. Some, some kind of root vegetable in the game. Whether or not it's in this biome is probably what it comes down to. You are a dead corn. Dried meat. We have dried meat. Hmm. Should we finish this episode? Is there enough time to go get a pooch? You're transporting. Do you... you your stats are actually pretty good. Let's try it. Let's see if it's something that can be done that quick. Otherwise, it may have to go into tomorrow. But let's add tame why am I, um, doggy. <laughs> tame dog. <laughs> yeah. So that's on the list. Let's, we'll follow you in. I was going to have her drop it and go get it, but she's got to come out to here anyway. So that works. Carter's transporting alloy. Uh, going around the corner with it. Yeah, because I didn't leave a pathway in here. Alright, handling a furnace. You're going to get more bricks coming for next time. Rita's dropping that off. Is she going to now run? Nope, she's just going to take her time. Probably, it probably is too late to do this. It might be. Yeah, let's, let's say that it is. Rita, break. And it's, it's going to be two in the morning probably before she finishes and doing this in the dark is not going to be the best recording we'll catch that next episode Edmund is bringing in Paulette is veggie soup okay yeah we've got hmm whenever she doesn't finish a meal it becomes an unfinished item which then goes over here with the crafting stuff it is so frustrating they've got unfinished items mixed in with coffee and moonshine and tea those are food items hopefully they uh, separate that out someday that's kind of awkward okay refrigeration we did get that and we have another leisure thing here oh different statues okay so refrigeration right there i do like the idea of a of a oh you've probably got to be completely indoors don't you that thing's huge and in a rainstorm, I would imagine that's going to have a problem. Um, how do we deal with that? I think we need to reorganize a bit. First of all, you need to move to here and rotate you around like that. Then I'm thinking this guy needs to move. Um, M. It is M, okay. To something like that but you can't do it so long as it's there even though it's the same item that's a little frustrating oh because of this uh, so I can't deal with you at all hmm if this one went to the back of that wall there maybe we can put this one kind of over here that might be possible cooking five nice okay it does really help to specialize these uh, these survivors mmm I'm hearing some mmms uh, Kona's crafting oh She's gone through the spear and is already working on the crafting, or the, the crossbow. What was she again? Uh, right there, I'm hearing a lot of wind all of a sudden. Uh, she's a six in crafting. Paulette is also a six. Okay. Hearing winds, but I don't see any evidence of it. Rita's transporting. So she walked over there to get those last four. <laughs> Okay, yeah, you just you just do you. Okay. Um, Paula is cooking. Simon is trying to research tea boiling. Okay, 
Then we're getting into what? Pacifier. Oh, some animals are too hostile to be tamed. But a modified version of the crossbow shooting poisoned bolts could solve this. Of course, such a weapon will only slow down the creature, and many of the arrows won't go deep enough to cause an effect. So that's going after some of the more dangerous ones. You've got to tranquilize them a bit. Yeah. Flamethrowers is interesting. We've got to have some serious fuel happening here to make that happen. Um... What else needs to be done? Oil extraction gave us oil, and oil was used for... That gives us fat, so I assume these are a cooking thing. And they are pretty quick, so we could pop those in real quick. Anything else that's important? Four days to make this. Hmm. Okay. Up in here, electric smelting. I think we'll stick to wood smelting. That um, seems like a, a huge power draw that's unnecessary for now um i don't see us getting into this for a while so oh it uses the uh um that the what, what are we calling that healing bomb as the poison okay incendiary traps uses fuel and alloys and that's expensive for us she, uh, spaceship deconstruction. Let's get that back in the list so we can get that torn down and see what's what else is in that, that ship over there. Concrete's going to be big. That really is. That's for making permanent walls that are going to be really hard to bust through. Yeah, we need that. And let's get the veggie armor going. Okay, then we'll pop in that and probably that next. Okay, since Simon's starting to plow through these so fast, I better get those in the head of time but for the moment Simon can you get this moved so I can do some things here and then can you get this moved that there that there and make this happen pause okay so where can I move this that will let me put a fridge in there is it even possible um, I want to move can I stagger these two like that. I can't. I can't put it there either. Oh, that's frustrating. I like having the second desk. I really do. But I don't know how to deal with it. I can't move the table around and have that work. And there's that music. I swear that means we're going to have an attack tomorrow. Um, I don't want to put refrigeration this far away. I could put another shelter in here. I could put another shelter in here. Hmm. We're just kind of stuck there. I could pop another shelter over here. And then we can keep the fridge right there. But if we're going to put another shelter in somewhere, I could put it over here for that matter. And it'd be right next to the stoves. There is that. What's that look like? Um, copy. That's the word I'm looking for. So, if we went down like so, it's three deep, though. It'd have to go, you know, this direction. So, it'd have to cross the pathway. That won't work. We could do something kind of awkward like that and get it in. That would work. Huh. We'll have to think about that. Give me your thoughts on that one. I like our setup so far. So I don't want to just start throwing things in randomly. And it'd be nice to be within the footprint of these poles already. That pole... They're not reaching each other anymore, are they? Oh, I guess it went from here to there and from here to there. Theoretically. It doesn't act like it's actually touching anymore. Uh, tea boiling is in there. Okay. Simon going to sleep. We can put that into the list here. Hot drinks. Um, tea boiling. Let's grab six of those. And I guess we should think about upping some of our quantities now that there are there's more of us here. Yeah, something like that. Fruit cakes. Lots of wind, but it's only right here. Oh, I keep thinking this is wind. 
It's got to be that. Okay. So we are coming to the close of another day. We got most of this hauled in. We did this a little bit left. And then there's this. And there's more over there. Okay. Pooch is over here. He's set for tame. Rita will probably do that on her own here real soon. And... I think we're about done. I'm still hearing noises. Somebody's... Oh, oh I didn't give her a break. Oh, she's going to kill me. <laughs> oh, she's so close and she's starving. Okay. Well, let me speed her up a little bit. And she's done. Disturb sleep, getting something to eat. And she'll be going to bed after that. She's not ready to break, though, because of this wonderful plus 50. That's what saved us. Okay, may as well take advantage of it. But with that, I think I need to call this quits. We're getting close to an hour-long video here. Yeah. All right, so thanks for watching, folks, and I'll catch you next time. Bye-bye.